Welcome to another Jaltesh Marine Vlog. We're going to be showing you how to connect to MTU engines. This brand is available under inboards and stationary engines. Let's do the example with inboards. Now click MTU and as you may know we have three types of VCMs, ADEX, MDES and DDEX. We can always use a system uh, search engine and we can filter by ADEX for example. Select the desired model and we can always double check the ECM we have clicking into the C image uh, symbol and you will see the ECM. This one is the ADEX. Now by clicking into the connection symbol it takes us to the plug selection. First image we have the connector location, the X4 socket, it's inside a panel. Uh, we have the pinout detail and third the cables we need. We have two options depending on the link interface. If it's the V8 link, the blue box, we have the JDC600 plus JDC61M, 619M or JDC213M3 plus JDC510A. We are V9 user with the black and white box we have the jdc 213.9 plus jdc 510a as you can see even if we're using the direct connector we have to use the cable to provide external power supply this is very important and preferably we should use the starter's engine and always use the same voltage as the ecm if we don't have the direct connector we can always use the multi-pin so you have a vlog where we show you how to use the multi pins. Now we click connect. We're inside, very simple. Now we disconnect and let's continue with the MDEX. Here we select MDEX. Again, we select the desired model and again, we can click into see image and you will see the ECM. In this case, you need to connect your diagnosis connector into the X6 socket. Now, again, we click into the connector symbol, plug selection. Now we have the plug uh, image or plug location, pinout detail and third, the cables we need. Uh, the MD cable is the JDC 537A, so we need to use, if we're using the blue box, the V8 link, the JDC 600 plus JDC 615M plus JDC 537A, or the JDC 213M3 plus JDC 537A. If we're a V9 link user, the black and white box, we have to use the 213.9 plus JDC 537A, and again, we need to provide power supply. Okay, this is the axis x6 socket and we click into connect and that's it we'll connect inside and it's very simple now we click into disconnect click to no and we click into ddex now we click into 60 series ddex 4 again we can see the ecm image this is the detroit diesel and again if we click into the connector symbol you will see the plug selection. This is our brand new 629A. Why? Because even if it's the six pin cable, it's not exactly the same on inboards as on stationary engines or trucks if you're using the six pin cable, which is the JDC 211A. In this case, JDC 213M3 plus JDC 629A, if we are using the V8 link, the blue box. Pin out deed and the third the cables we need. We can always use the multi pins as well. And if we are using the black and white box, we have to use the JDC 213.9 plus JDC 629A. And here we don't have to provide external power supply and we click connect. And we're inside. Okay, so it's very simple. We explain how to do every step one brand, three types of DCMs, sometimes. The users have some trouble in order to connect because it's a different process, different cables. But you have seen that's very, very simple. Thank you for watching and see you again very soon.